Hello, today I'm going to be showing you um, uh, how to make a um, score for kind of every type of game that you make. Um, it's kind of a regular score, so when you tap that for the score to increase, and when you tap that for the score to decrease, and when you move to the next room for the score to increase, and more stuff like that. Let's jump right into this. First, we're going to create an object. We do not need a sprite because a sprite is an image. We're going ahead and we're going to create our object. So we're going to name it O Test Score. Okay, basically, object test score. Um, we don't need a sprite or an image because it is just kind of a holding variable type of thing. It's confusing. Um, we're going to go ahead and click the create event. Now, this is drag and drop. You can make, um, you can make uh, these in drag and drop, and you can also make them in coding. I'm going to use coding today. So let's go ahead inside of the extract code, and let's just go ahead and make our variable. So global dot points, um, global dot points equals zero, um, basically. Okay. And what we're the next thing we're gonna do is we need a draw event. Because basically, the score cannot draw without a draw of it. So we have our extract code again, just basically coding in drag and drop. Because, you know, I, I like to do videos on drag and drop. So um, I, I'm learning coding while I use drag and drop for my simpler video games and coding for the harder types of video games. Okay, so um, we're going to write draw text. Uh, sorry. Draw uh set underscore color um let's see underscore we're gonna say white we're gonna say white and just close the door okay now where in the room do we want to actually draw our image that's a hard point now i want it to be like in the corner so let's say 50 40 okay we're going to say that. So draw underscore text. Um, okay. Um, I forgot. Okay, yeah. What do we say? 40, 50? 40, 50? Or no, 50, 40. I don't know. Let's just try this. Um, so basically, this is just going to draw our text where we told it to do. So 40 pixels, 50 pixels, Y, X coordinates. kind of does that itself. Okay, and we're going to tell it what to draw, right? So global dot points, right? So basically, we're just telling it to draw the global dot points white in the direction that we want it to. Now, we need a way to increase this matter here. Oh, no, I'm sorry about that. Um, increase this matter. So basically, we're going to drag this in, and we're just going to go ahead and import one. Um, I have lots of save save files over here in my pictures. Um, let's just, you know, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to use this one. I'm going to use this one because it doesn't really have a background. It just, I'm going to use this one. Um, so, let's see. Uh, let's name it Sprite Test. Now what we need to tell this, oh yeah, we're going to make an object first, because it needs an object now, uh, to actually spawn on your board. This is just images, so we can close that, that's useless. So object test, she's going to say object test, okay, and now we actually need to write it what it's going to do. So, um, in computer video games, if you're making a computer video game, most likely you would say when it's when it's released, um, right, or something, uh, for it to increase, but if you're going to make, like, a Kindle Fire game, which I'm just going to show you, very simply, just press the tab, it's just much simpler, and it works for computer and Kindle and whatever device, I think, I just know computer and Kindle because it says tap, so tap your finger or tap the thing, tap any type of device, okay, let's get back into it. 
we're going to do the extract code. Oh yeah, let's also give it a little thing. I, I'm gonna do that, a little like effect. I'm gonna do that just because it, it looks cool and stuff. So maybe like um fireworks. Mouse underscore X and mouse underscore Y. Just telling it where to go. And basically, looks like, um, so it's going to be money. So I guess we can make it like a yellow. And let's make this large so you can actually see it above firework. Okay, so let's get back in where we were writing it. Okay. Now. What we're going to do now is increase what we, what the variable that we made. So what we're going to say is global.points equals global.points. Let's move over so then we can see. Um, plus 1. And you're going to basically do the same thing. So minus 1 uh, plus 1,000. Basically, that's what you're going going to do. So we're going to do one, and then just semicolon. I think that's what it's called. Uh, comments down below what it's called. I think it's semicolon. Yeah, semicolon. Okay. Um, object test, and we have our um our score right here. Okay. So let's just run the game. So basically, we just created a video game that could be bigger and better and made bigger, better and made bigger. Okay, maybe you can't see that too good. Um, I think you could see it good enough. Okay, yeah. You could see it good enough. So basically, this is just running around animation. And this is zero. If you tap it, uh, let's see where we went wrong. Oh, yeah, typo. Sorry. It's a typo. I wrote global points. Okay, now it's run the game. Now it's run the game. Now it's going to work. I'm sorry. My fault. Everyone makes mistakes. It was just a typo. Now happen but it's not increasing for some reason. Um let's take a look global dot points equals global dot points plus one. Uh, this might be making the computer when it, it does this before um because the computer reads the downwards so we're just gonna do this this probably will work I don't know, these still might be typo bugs and stuff. Um, should work. This is what happens when you do it from your memorization and from what you learned from playing around and messing around. This is what happens. Okay, yeah. So if you look, now it increased. And you could actually make this into a tap uh, game, like a tycoon game, where once you tap the buy button, it increases the tapping of the... Um, the coin, please comment down below in what video you want me to show you. Increasing, tapping, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, it should be good. Okay, increasing, tapping, all type of stuff, a store, um, all type of that stuff, um, and all that stuff. Remember to like, subscribe, and leave comments down below in the video you want me to do next. I'll see y'all later. Goodbye.